Breaking news from the royal family, Princess Anne, the Queen's daughter, was a no-show at the coronation concert held at Windsor Castle, while the rest of the royals, including King Charles and Queen Camilla, were present to enjoy the highly anticipated event. Princess Royal was nowhere to be seen. Concerns were raised for her welfare, as she took on a significant role during the coronation itself. But before we start panicking, let's delve deep into the possible reasons for her absence. One of the most likely reasons is that Princess Anne is a practical woman who doesn't waste her time on frivolous events. She has a full schedule of royal duties and engagements, and it's possible that she decided to skip the concert for the sake of efficiency. After all, she had already made a surprise appearance at a Coronation Street party in Swindon earlier that day, alongside Vice Admiral Sir Tim Lawrence. Princess Anne spoke to the people who organized the event and dozens of attendees. She even brought a personal contribution of food to the lunch, which shows how involved she is in community affairs. It's no wonder that Jeremy Holt, a member of the organizing committee for the big lunch street party, said he was in awe of the number of official engagements that Princess Royal performs each year. Moreover, after such a busy day, Princess Anne perhaps couldn't face the drive back to London especially when she was scheduled for another appearance on Sunday back in Swindon. Both she and her husband are attending a community street party as part of the Big Help Out festivities that will continue on the Monday bank holiday to celebrate the King's coronation. The public has been encouraged to take up hundreds of thousands of volunteering roles on the extra bank holiday, with more than 1,500 charities involved. And it's no surprise that Princess Anne is a patron of numerous charities and organizations, and she is known for her active involvement in the community. So while the rest of the royals were enjoying the concert, Princess Anne was most likely busy fulfilling her royal duties. It's not the first time that she has missed a high-profile event, and it won't be the last. The princess role is a no-nonsense role that gets things done. She takes her role as gold, sticking to waiting very seriously, acting as the king's bodyguard, and being entrusted with the king's safety. During the coronation itself, she led a procession of armed forces personnel behind King Charles and Queen Consort Camilla's carriage on horseback as they left Westminster Abbey and returned to Buckingham Palace. That's a significant responsibility. And it's no wonder that she takes her royal duties seriously. While the coronation was a star-studded event featuring actors, singers, and entertainers, including pop royalty Take That, Katy Perry, Liam Ritchie, and even Cometh the Frog, it's not surprising that Princess Anne chose to skip it. After all, she had more important things to do such as fulfilling her role as a patron of various charities and organizations and attending community events. It's clear that the princess role is dedicated to making a difference in helping others, and that's what matters most. In conclusion, Princess Anne's absence from the coronation concert should not be a cause for concern. She is a practical woman who takes her royal duties seriously and is dedicated to making a difference in the community. While the rest of the royals were enjoying the concert, Princess Anne was busy fulfilling her role as a patron of numerous charities and organizations. Let's not forget that the princess role is a no-nonsense role that gets things done, and that's what makes her a valuable member of the royal family.